Ready to go? I don't want to miss the previews. Me neither. I love the previews. In fact, I enjoy being the theater cut-up. Hmm. Last week after a preview, I yelled out, must miss. I think that I was in that theater. That, that was really funny. Yeah, I got a good laugh. <laughs> Let me just check my messages before we go. So you're on the speed dial? After two dates. What number? Seven. Well, you know, it's a pain to change that. You gotta lift up that plastic thing with a pen. Hi. Sorry I'm late. There's a lot of chairs and balloons in my apartment. How about I make it up to you with dinner? Someplace nice this time? Yeah, I'm sorry about that Mongolian barbecue last night. I had heard good things. I don't know. Got a two in Zagat's. Let me just uh, check my messages. Maybe a nicer girl called. Hello? Hello? Who is this? Jane. What number did you dial? Seven? <laughs> to do that. I mean, the dinner and the play and the handsome cab ride. Well, I just wanted to. You forgot the gift certificate to Barnes & Noble. Oh. You know, make a good impression. I'm gonna go put these in some water. I like the way you think. <laughs> oh, my God. Number one. <laughs> Seinfeld, you magnificent bastard. <laughs> Hi, Valerie. You're not Valerie. I'm her stepmother. Drive. It's taken me 13 years to climb up to the top of that speed dial, and I don't intend to lose my spot to you. But I never... You just stay away from that phone. You know, uh, Valerie, I uh, couldn't help but notice that I'm on your speed dial. You deserve it. But I, I can't help thinking that maybe there's someone in your life who deserves it more. Someone you've known, you know, more than a week. My stepmother got to you, didn't she? What? No. I can't believe she did this again. That's it. She's off the speed dial completely. Yikes. Well, Mrs. Hamilton, it's certainly nice that you and Valerie patched things up so we could all get together like this. Where is Valerie? I'm sure she'll be along. Have some wine, Jerome. Okay. You know, Jerome, I can understand what Valerie sees in you. So attractive, so strong, so comedic. Good. Jerome. I have a deliciously naughty idea. What? Why don't I put you on my speed dial? I don't know, Mrs. Hamilton. That doesn't don't sound... Don't be such a child, Jerome. House number three sound. Valerie's not coming over, is she? Seven, four, no. two... No. Stop, stop. This isn't right. What about Valerie? I won't tell if you don't. Hello? Jerry, I was just at my stepmom's house and I saw that you were on her speed dial. Uh, well, she uh, probably just wanted to be able to keep tabs on you. Hold on a second. Hello? Hi, Jerome. Oh, Mrs. Hamilton, this is a very bad time. I've got Valerie on the other line. Just a second. Hello? That's her on the other line, isn't it? Well... Tell her I don't want you on her speed dial. Hang on. She knows about the speed dial. Mrs. Hamilton, you gotta get me off this thing. I won't until she puts me back on hers. Hang on. She wants to be back on yours. Fine, but only if you're off hers. Hang on. Fine, if I'm off yours. No, still me. Sorry, hang on. Fine, if I'm off yours. I won't do it. It's my speed dial and I don't trust her. Please, Mrs. Hamilton, this is very awkward for me. All right. I'll hide you in one of the emergency buttons. Great, bye. She said she'll do it. Great. <laughs>